Welcome back to the 71st episode of a close combat last stand on and play two with the Germans in the gang campaign on elite difficulty. Once again, we're here in Son, and I have now got this Fallschirmjäger um, regiment here to support the um, 59th Infantry Division. No, that's not who they are. Uh, yeah, we got we got two groups in here, basically. I'm not entirely sure what the deal is, but yeah, let's... Uh... Oh, look at that. Uh, they're running pretty low in points, so we've taken out quite a few of the units uh, previously here. So let's get some units in from the uh, support team here. Uh, let's give them glider teams. Ah, well, maybe we'll give them the 50 cal heavy machine guns. That sounds pretty annoying to deal with, so let's do that. And a bar team. There we go. They also have three 30 cal medium machine gun teams, so now they have a lot of machine gun firepower here, which I'm actually not that happy about, but oh well, we'll, uh, we'll go for it. And there we go. Not many points left for them. Uh, the reserves are still numerous though. So, return to play. Let's see. Um, Falsham Jäger MG. Yeah, I think I might want to replace those so we can have them back again at full strength. Uh, we have a company trip and uh, this gun here still up and running from the previous time. We were fighting with these guys. Either way, let's get the uh, MG teams in here. Uh, medium anti tank gun, which is pointless. And then, other than that, another command team. Let's maybe just get that in together with uh, the mortar team and another MG team. And then the reserve team here. Uh, well, let's edit reserve if we can and see. Yeah, I guess it'll be some of these machine guns uh, we put in from them. So, uh, these for sure, and that. So, okay, we have three light machine gun teams, one of them with an MG-42. Uh, we got a lot of MGs, basically, but I'm not so sure we can actually push the enemy this time. And them having a 50 cal, or two 50 cal med uh, machine guns now, that's potentially quite dangerous for us. Now we can see clearly when we're deploying here now, but it is night time, so that's just something to keep in mind. I wonder if we can put this in a building. No, that was the thing. We could not do that. Okay, we'll put it here then and hope the 50 cal stones spray it down. Even if they do, it's not really that big of a loss, so I can't say I, I would cry tremendously if that happened, but either way. Let's put this uh, light machine gun team here together with the other 34 light machine gun. Uh, so the M the other MG34 I mean, and we'll also have the MG42 on the corner here, so three MG teams situated in this building, that should do, only 450 rounds on each, as per usual, and we have MG teams, Grenadier MG teams, Fallschirmjäger MG teams, I mean, uh, with MG42s, so we can maybe get a couple of those put into this three-story building here. So we can shoot out, and the total ammo count here is, uh, well, let's see, it's like 2,250 rounds among these teams, which is, you know, the same as one heavy machine gun team. It should be a decent amount, really. Um, yeah, I'm just going to hide the uh, mortar team, they're pretty expensive, so I'm just going to put them back here this time as well. Uh, I can put a company trip right here, and I also want the MG team over there. Covering towards the bridge, and we could maybe counterattack the enemy this time, but I don't think so. I, I don't think we're going to really be trying to do that. Maybe we will, but I'm putting a lot of teams on the wrong side of the map for that, but, well, either way. Got a command team, where is it? Where are they? Where are they hiding? There they are. Put them in over here as well. So we have five teams here that we could make a move with, which is not all that, to be honest, but let's just see what we can do. 
Yeah, well, that'll pretty much tell you in a new one, huh? Let's get the Mortal team on them, maybe. Not sure. The guys in the forest could do with some Mortal. Fire on top of them. It's really ridiculous that the mortar isn't already set up. You've, you, you've set up people in defensive positions, and for some reason the mortar has not been set up. Which I find to be a bit silly. Right, hey, that's just me. Okay, these guys are fucked no matter what they're doing. They're not going anywhere. They're in a really bad position. I think we got the guy here, maybe. Maybe not. Right, let's just hold the mortar fire for now. Wait for a better opportunity. Hopefully we're not burning off too much ammo. No, oh, we're trying to rush the bridge now. That isn't going to work out too well for them. Yeah, we're inflicting heavy casualties, but they have at least five machine gun teams, which is potentially going to be a problem. Oh, I'm hearing, I'm hearing 50 cal fire, it seems like from just across surf. In this general area. Okay, let's throw illumination here. There's a 50 cal team. Let's fuck them up if we can. Guys, we're illuminating them. Give them hell, please. Okay, we're doing good damage on now. This 50 cal team does not have much left. There's one guy left, but he will be manning the 50 cal, so... But that, okay. We're down one, uh, one heavy machine gun team, that's good. And we took out the two in HQ and the rifle team. Taking out a ball team. So they have four machine gun teams left. That was a decent mortar strike there. I think maybe we just hold our mortar fire for now, though. And give them a while more to just try to take the bridge. Then we can counter-attack later on and hopefully uh, push them off the map. But I find that to be unlikely. What I kind of want to do is uh, switch over so that one of these groups that are in Son now go into Eindhoven to defend there. And then the Panther that we have in Eindhoven, we can move that in here to maybe be able to just assert dominance and uh, take over the map. Maybe. That's a potential for the next turn. We might do that. Machine gun team here is out of ammo. The MG42 burns it off real quick. And uh, I'm taking a few casualties here, but not too many. Two guys dead on the south side of the river. It's not too bad. Ammunition is, however, in low supply when it comes to the MGs, and that is our main issue here. We need, like, a heavy machine gun team so we can have more MG ammo to go around. Okay, we lost a guy here as well, I noticed. And our team leader is injured. I guess this could take a while. I mean, it is a nighttime engagement, so that kind of changes how things play out a little bit. Taking out this rifle team as well. I mean, they're running so low on points, so they might not even be able to... Like, if we can take out more of the teams now, they might not actually be able to replace enough teams to be able to fully field... Well, a full 15 squad uh, team. Keep your heads down. Which could give us a future... Um, advantage. Would be nice if it did. So I think we're just going to be playing it uh, patient here and wait for them to come in with more units that we can just mow down, hopefully. And uh, in the future for doing that, we should be having an easier time counter-attacking here now and taking out these goddamn battalions. 
Hope it gates, whatever it is. Okay, we got another team trying to get to the bridge. That's the same engineer team seemingly. It's not gonna work out too well for them. At all. Oh, there's another team right there. <laughs> okay, well. Alright, there goes the engineer team. Uh, there's probably one guy still alive in the area here from another team. So, just because, why not? We're gonna start throwing mortars at that guy. He's in the area here somewhere, so. At least we took out a 50 cal team. I'm not so sure they have too many 50 cal teams in the reserve. Although I'm a bit bothered with them having them at all, because it's, uh, yeah, it's pretty strong, the 50 cal. I can just keep shooting. Nope, shoot your last shell as well. Go, go, go. Yeah, now you can stop shooting, that's fine. No, we're just gonna keep them there, it doesn't really matter. They're not really that combat effective with the rifles and whatnot. They always seem to mess up in some way when I try to use them for something. Uh, but okay, I'm a little bit impatient. Let's see if they want a truce. It's whatever, there we go, let's see, details, three of our guys got incapacitated, we killed seven, incapacitated 30, 37 enemies down, it's a nighttime engagement, so it's uh, slow going and such. Uh, if we had a bit more patience, we could be better off in the future, but I don't think we necessarily need to be better off in the future, to be honest. If we come in here with a panther, maybe two, then uh, they will be in trouble. And we'll also have a heavy machine gun team coming in with the Panther group, but we need to, or the Panzer group, but we need to do a rotation. So we'll see if we can make that happen. Either way, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, I would appreciate if you left a like on it and maybe even subscribed uh, to my channel for some future content. That being said, you can catch me in the next one. So have a good one.